a lot of times I tell people, even the kids that I coach right now, we have a club team in Menifee. Here's a new club team. And I stress to these kids, it's tough. Track and field is tough. But if you're good at it, we could get you an education paid for and save your parents some money and save you some money where you're walking away, graduating from university with zero debt, and you basically got paid to make your body look better. Yeah. <laughs> it's a win-win. You're getting, and you get to register classes before seniors. Mm-hmm. You're going to never have an issue with getting the classes you want. You get to do a little traveling and you get to make your body look nice, which is going to carry you through life. Those yeah. muscles will always be there. Yeah. And you compete. That's the biggest deal I tell yes. those student athletes. You, you learn to compete. You, you, have, you have teammates that are good. You have competitors that are good. You, I always say competing as a, as a collegiate athlete makes you much better when you hit the professional world because you've had to go to practice and class and travel and, you know, still do your schoolwork. And then when you get to the professional world, you're, you're competitive where a regular student may just have been going to class. You know? Oh, absolutely. You're, you're in a whole different mind frame and you have that edge as an athlete going into the real world because you've been drugged up and down the track and vomiting and IVs and legs cramping in class and, you know, you got to lift weights in the morning, then you got to go to class and you got to get on the track at one o'clock or two o'clock when it's 100 degrees in the track. People don't realize those tracks are 130 degrees because mm-hmm. of the surface heat and you're training in that. And then you got to go from there to the training room to get your body worked out, giving you aches and pains. Then from there, you got to eat and then you got to go to another class and you got to study and you got to wake up the next day and do that all again. And what happens if you catch a cold? Mm-hmm. My son right now. He's, he's taking a summer term. He's taking biology and he caught a cold. So he has to train, go to class and fight a cold all at the same time yeah. and no exceptions. It's reality. So it definitely makes you a very uh, a powerful human being where the sky's the limit if you're an athlete in college because the adversity you have to deal with, the stuff you have to work through, uh, the difficulties of the levels of difficulties, it's nothing you can't do if you've been through that, literally. I mean, I see my little kids right now. I mean, we have a girl out there. She was running through the workout crying. She was running and crying. And I said, hey, just keep up the good job. This will benefit you down the road. I know you don't see it now, but just trust in the program. This will benefit you down the road and you will make your family proud. So she smiled and she kept fighting, kept working on the track. So uh, it's a great sport to instill value. 